while Trey Lance and Sam Darnold are splitting reps with the first team today when Brock isn't playing or splitting reps with the second team when Brock does play, the reps aren't the same because Darnold is getting to throw to starters, Debo, Ayuk, Jawan Jennings, while Lance is mostly throwing to backups, Chris Conley, Tay Martin, Braden Willis. And that's very interesting because I feel like the untrained eye wouldn't make wouldn't even notice it. Most reporters aren't going to talk about that. They're going to say, hey, both guys are getting second team reps. Both guys are splitting the reps. Darnold's numbers were these. Trey's numbers were these. Darnold's better. But I think it matters who you're throwing to. Here's, here's a stat. Through four days, through four days of camp, Trey Lance has thrown to Brandon Ayuk one time. One time. And he completed the pass. And it was on day one. Remember, day one of camp, Trey Lance was five of six. He was throwing to Jennings. He was throwing to Debo. He was throwing to Ayuk. He was five of six. Ever since then, he's been buried, and he's been throwing two backups. While Brandon Allen had a touchdown pass to Brandon Ayuk today. Like, Kyle Shanahan said, Brandon, go run a route with the third stringers because Brandon Allen needs a good uh, look. We need to get Brandon Allen a good look. So, Brandon... Ayuk, go run another route. Go tax your body a little bit more for Brandon Allen, but not for Trey. And we're not supposed to notice that. I think that's kind of fishy. Here's my interpretation. I have a feeling that Trey Lance, I don't know. I don't think he wants to be here. Right? He was the third pick in the draft. He had options. He could have gone anywhere. He ended up here, and they've buried him now, and they've moved on, and they want him to be okay being a backup. I think he'd like to leave. I think he's probably unhappy. He may have even requested a trade at some point. They're not going to trade him because they know they can't keep a quarterback healthy for more than a month and a half. So they're sticking with him as a backup. In the meantime, it feels like they're punishing him. Oh, you don't want to be here? Well, you have to be here. And we'll let you compete, but it's a backup quarterback competition, and we're going to stack the deck against you. Because while you're throwing to Tay Martin and Chris Conley, Sam Darnold's going to be throwing to Debo Samuel and Brandon Ayuk. So why don't you just shut up and play football? That's the way I look at it. I feel like Brandon Allen, happy to be here. Brock Purdy, last pick in the draft, happy to be here. Sam Darnold, third team in his career, washing out of the league, grateful to be here. Is Trey Lance grateful to be here? Absolutely not. I'm sure he would love to get moved. I'm sure he would love to get traded months ago. And you know what? They're not going to do him a solid. They're going to bust his chops at best. Humiliate him at worst. Hey, uh, Trey, you got any more requests? You got any more requests? Because I'm all ears. I'm, I'm receptive. What do you want? What can we do for you, Trey? Oh, you want to get traded? How about we bury you on the depth chart, give you, give Brandon Allen better reps than you, and you can spend all offseason throwing to guys who won't make the team. How's that sound? That's what we're watching right now. Hard to take it seriously. I do feel bad for Trey. I think he's getting sabotaged. What, all because he's not grateful to be part of the 49ers? Why should he be grateful? Josh Wyatt says, how does the right side pass protection look? Are these really completions by Darnold or regular season sacks? Pass go on tomorrow, Joshua. Pass go on tomorrow. Bear with us. Let's not jump to conclusions about trench play before the pads go on. Pass go on tomorrow. One-on-ones are going to start. I will give you in-depth, detailed analysis about these trench players. Francisco says, maybe it's Trey's turn on first team reps tomorrow. Uh, no, Brock's back. Nitin Kumar says, I think they are preparing to trade Darnold at this point because it's like they are going out of their way to make Darnold look good with Ayuk, LOL. They're not trading anyone, man. They know they can't get quarterbacks. They can't keep quarterbacks healthy. They know their offensive line is worse than last year. They are holding Trey hostage and rubbing it in his face. Nee says, honestly, it's probably better for Trey since when he's in the preseason games, he's not going to be in with Debo and Ayuk. Better for Trey. Whew. If I were Trey, I wouldn't feel that way. <laughs> what do you think about A.J. Parker? He was the guy that 
Brandon Ayuk kept beating when Sam Darnold was thrown on the ball. It seemed like the Niners really wanted Darnold to look good today and are sort of going out of the way to make Trey look bad. Maxime Laflame says, destroying Trey's confidence to flip Brandon Allen for a seventh round pick is 40 chess. Well, that's why everyone says Kyle's so smart because he just sees 18 moves ahead.